You know, there are so many different ways of raising money when it comes to different causes. But when it comes to our veterans, one local group is getting pretty creative. ABC 6 News reporter Jenna Losey brings us to Lake Zumbro, where vets are taking to the water. Keep your knees together. Don't pull yourself up. Let the boat pull you. It was a day of learning. Woo! A day of camaraderie between veterans and their families. You aren't going to be able to maneuver much? While trying their hand. There you go. Or should I say foot at water skiing. It's just fun. <laughs> Shannon Larson served in the Army for 20 years, and while she's not a wounded warrior, her husband is. It's not all what you can see on the outside. It's a lot of what you see, what you don't see on the inside. Shannon is on the Ski Docks water ski team. It was their job Wednesday to get these families up behind a boat. It's something that everyone of all physical capabilities can do. This is an adaptive ski uh, for people with disabilities. We have two skiers on each side, uh, keeping people upright so that they don't tip over. It puts a big smile on everybody's face knowing that they can do it. Some looked like a pro their first time around, but for others, mastering the skis took a few tries. Those guys uh, fought for our country. That's. Uh big for us and if we, if we can give them just a little bit back even one day that's what we want to do the day was meant to raise money for the wounded warrior project but more importantly it's a way to get local disabled veterans out on the water for a stress-free good time on lake zumbro jenna losi abc6 news and it looks like a huge success. You know, organizers are hoping to make this an annual event for our vets. All the money raised will go to the Wounded Warriors Project, all of the proceeds.